Hey guys, welcome back to another video from A Level Lessons. And in this video, we're going to be looking at uh, your profits right, for your market structure. In this video specifically, we're going to be covering on your subnormal profits. Right, a lot of you guys always ask, how do you actually indicate on a diagram or how do you draw the diagram? So let's find out now. So first of all, let's uh, always remember to mark your zero. Okay, so firstly, you want to find what the profit maximizing output and price of the firm is. So that is uh, where MR cuts MC. So just draw a line up from MR where it intersects your demand curve, right? Because that is where uh, the demand is at, right? From your MR and MC intersection. And you would have your P1 as well as your Q1 over here uh, that uh, we have found from the intersection of MR and MC, right? So Q1, P1. Right, when you're looking at the case of subnormal profits, we're looking at a curve of AC that is more than AR, right? As we have learned before in our topical series. So we're going to draw an AC curve over here that just looks something like this, right? It's just, it's just a curve that will occur above your AR curve. And how do we find out the profits, right? We have to always look at first our profit maximizing output and simply plot, right, the quantity where it intersects our AC. Right here is where we'll find that this is where the cost of our um, production is actually at, right? C1, uh, the average cost that we're incurring when we are at this profit maximizing output. And you realize that C1, uh, this shaded area, is basically our, sup uh, our subnormal profits. Right? And you realize that C1 is more than P1. It shows that our cost is actually more than our price. Right? Our average cost is more than our price. So therefore, in this case, since your P, which is your price, is going to be less than your AC, uh, and as we have learned before, P equals to uh, your AR. AR is less than AC. We are at a case where we are earning sub-normal profits. So that's quite a simple part, right? So it's the same thing. Just look for your profit maximizing output and look for the part where this quantity will intersect your AC to find out what the price and what the cost is like. So if you did learn something, uh, hopefully you did, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for the next few parts on the other profit types. See you then.